I cannot hate on no nigga, just gotta wait my turn Chasing the check, it ain't nothing but a word Lean to the side every time that I swerve Hold on, baby, gotta twist my, my, uh, She throw it back on me, the bag will burn We ain't getting money, oh, what you heard? What's up, y'all? It's your boy Sash and TV back with another video uh, about the baby. This time, more updates in regards to the Miami robbery case. Now, his mugshot has been posted via TMZ. Now, when I saw this title right here, I almost didn't want to, I almost didn't believe it. I kind of laughed. I was like, "What?" Now, robbery and assault is never a joke, of course. But what they describe him right here sounds ridiculous. Sounds something like sounds like something out of a damn comedy movie, if you ask me. <clears throat> Check this out. It says, uh, according to this article right here on TMZ that you're about to see in a couple seconds, the baby had allegedly robbed the victim for eighty dollars, <laughs> a credit card, and then poured apple juice on him, according to the police report which TMZ obtained. They also said that the sugar rapper had allegedly took the victim's iPhone 7 as well. And the reason this all occurred was because the baby felt that the concert promote that the victim, which is a concert promoter, had shortened him out of some money. Now, also, according to this police report, the promoter had gave the baby 20K but the baby had told him that he, he, he had owed him 34 a concert he was supposed to uh, do on Thursday. And that was when uh, dude ended up getting, that's how dude ended up getting beat up in the street on that, on that video. Allegedly, because we have not seen no faces yet. And they have not been able to put two and two together, point out, or prove anybody was in the video. Because you really couldn't see from up there. You really couldn't see what happened. You couldn't see who whose face it was except for the victim. Now, of course, the baby has been arrested for and charged with battery in connection to the robbery investigation. And his bond is set at $1,500. Now, um... <clears throat> Now, experts like Boosie's lawyers said that are saying that this uh, that this case could potentially be dropped due to Miami PD's reputation of just sure laziness, which I mean, I know of certain police uh, uh, police departments reputation across America due to their brutality. But I don't think I've ever maybe I need to do more research. I never heard of uh, Miami PD being that reputable for being lazy because normally they be on stuff like, of course, the violent crimes, the murders. You know, the uh, the drugs, the cocaine, they be on that stuff. But I didn't know they had a reputation for being lazy. But yeah, tell, that was, that was, that was um, tell, I'll keep y'all updated as the story progresses, man. Tell what y'all think about it in the comment section. Hit the like button, subscribe, share, and comment for more videos. Hit the bell button so you can be notified when I upload a new video. And as always, thank you for tuning to Sag Season TV. I'm out.